Hey folks, hope you'll pardon that I'm sweating like a pig. It's 95 degrees out here today, so my sunroom's really warm. But I wanted to show you the progress on my cable system. I'm still waiting on a bunch of hardware, but I wanted to show basically what I've got. And then, just use your imagination, I'll double it up on the other side. But what I've got here, let me go ahead and get around to the other side of the camera. So what I have is a loading pin, and what this does, it lets me put weight on. You'll notice these are some new cap barbell grip plates, because if I use the other kind of plates, I can't grab them. Um, but it's loaded up with 50 pounds right now, and then here, I attach cable to the top here, and uh, then it lets me do various exercises. So I'll go ahead and attach a cable. There, I'm going one-handed because my tripod broke, but here's the loading pin, carabiner, and then the cable. Got that other video where I showed where the cables are. As we go up now, I've got this pulley. This is just a cheap kind of pulley that you would get at Tractor Supply. My Tractor Supply sucks. They never have the things they're supposed to have in stock. But I got the kind that has a swivel at the top. It's rated to, I think, 680 pounds. So it goes over and then down here on the other side. And then this is where my lap pull-down bar is. So you just obviously do the reps of your exercise this way. What's limiting me right now and what I'm waiting for is these things are called shackles from Titan. I'm waiting for these to go on sale again and then I'm gonna buy several more uh, to create other attachment points. But you'll see in the videos, having two of them lets me do high and low. And then I'm gonna go ahead and set this thing up for some basic cable flies. Okay, so that's just way too hot out there today, but I think you can see the potential there, even just with two shackles. Uh, I'm able to do a lot of the exercises, really, that you can do. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm waiting for the opportunity to order more shackles, and then that what that'll allow me to do is position a second pulley up and down the bar of the uh, cage. So I'll demonstrate that. That'll be the part three of finishing up the gym renovation. But just wanted to show you guys that even with just a little bit of stuff I have now, still a useful system. So what I've got now, if you just had a single cage and you bought a pair of shackles, a pair of shackles is like 30 something dollars, 40 something dollars, something like that. But just buying two shackles and two pulleys and then some cables, you could set up most of what I was doing there on a single cage system really easily. Uh, the difficulty is maybe just getting the cables, I guess. So, but other than that, really, it's, it's pretty easy stuff. So, minimal expense, you could add cable capability to one uh, rack, one T3 rack or one R3 rack. And I've seen some other things like the Spud ink system. This just seems way more solid to me. So, this will probably be the last thing I do on cables or the crossover system until I get the rest of the components and then you'll see what the finished thing looks like. But already, as you can see, it can already do a whole lot of stuff.